to see if he's done him a favor by getting him this opportunity against a much more experienced fighter. We'll also see how much Kevin Kelly has left. Kelly was unbeaten before his January 7, 1995 war with Alejandro Gonzalez. It hasn't been easy for him since then. For one or two shots, that's not going to happen that easy. But he landed a left hand over the top and has gotten Gaynor's attention as he now pins him against the ropes and tries to go to the body. Kevin Kelly thinks that his punching power can make the difference. Strong sequence of body punches. And Gaynor with a big comeback. Derek Gaynor still, for the most part, beating Kevin Kelly to the punch. This will be called a slip. That's that quick overhand left. Around. He might have missed the punch that landed. We'll get a look at that later. Gaynor sees it. And now Gaynor goes down. That hurt This too. is going to be called a knockdown. All right, let's see if we can take a look and see what happened. There was the knockdown, a clean, hard punch. Three punch combination, four punches, five punches, six punches by Gaynor. And Kelly goes down, and his right eye is a mess. He took a shot early before that combination landed. I was just trying to cover up and get through the round. There you saw the off the right hand claiming he has been thumbed. You think anything has happened in this fight so far, guys? <laughs> wow, Kevin Kelly's right eye is functionally closed. It's a total mess. And he's fighting like he want to win anyway. And you heard his trainer, Phil Borgia, saying, forget it. You're just going to have to work around it. And down goes Gaynor. And he's hurt. He's wobbled. Kevin Kelly drawing on his desperation. And now he takes leather in return. Pay close attention to me. Look in my eye. Look what you did with one eye. All right? Pay attention to me. Here's the knockdown as the almost one-eyed Kevin Kelly lands a looping left. Has anybody seen Kelly? I've seen Kelly. Wait, left hand. But I think he's starting to hurt Gaynor to the body with shots and like that. hurt him means hurting him good. That's correct. Huh? Wait, wait, and then you tag him. Gainer able to... There you see the big left hand. No, I think he can go. Yeah, can he can see? go. I can't, I can't see out of what I'm fighting. I'm Let's ready. go. Can you see out of the other eye? Can you see out of that eye? I can see. Okay. You can gotta see. work, Doc. You gotta work. Only to see out of the right eye, and it's hurting him in a lot of different ways, both defending himself and mounting offense. But now here he comes again as he's able to pin Gainer against the ropes. And this is when he does his best work. Well, that Gainer's sharp. Chance to come back and go upstairs. Gainer's hands still fast. One thing about when your eyes are closed, you have this itchy feeling all over your body, and you just want to touch and protect yourself a lot more than you want to fight. Kelly stunned. Stunned now as Gainer pounds him against the ropes. That's He's trying everything he's got. You wonder why Gaynor would even fight this kind of fight when he can really clearly stay on the outside and win. Blood trickling from Kevin Kelly's nostrils now. Both sides bleeding. Down goes Gaynor. A left hand. A big, big left hand. And Gaynor may not get up. He will not get up. He fight a fight like that. Arturo got Kevin it. Kelly visited. has done it. Arturo. Or the old Billy Conn, Joe Lewis story. You're winning a fight, now I'm going for a knockout also. And it happens to him. Billy Conn. Looking at an opponent that he felt he had on the, on the ropes and walks right into a big, wild left hand. Dropped his right hand at the same moment that he threw the left. That was the difference. Watch the right hand drop when Gaynor commits to this left hand. Boom. All night, 
He's been landing that shot. Those have been the same shot that's knocked him down one after the other.